Welcome to Enthrill Books, and thank you for purchasing an ebook card. Or if someone bought one for you as a gift, give them a big hug from us, okay? The Enthrill ebook card is a brand new product, the first of its kind in the market, bridging the world of print and digital. As with anything new, there are a few things to learn. This video will walk you through the few simple steps required to get your new ebook onto your e reading device. Watch it all the way through once so that you're familiar with the process. If you need to watch it again during your download, click the play video button, pause it as needed, and resume when ready. Okay, let's get started. Let's go to the Enthrow website and redeem your ebook. You can do that from the Redeem page or directly from the home page. Type in the 12 digit Enthrill code located inside your Enthrill ebook card. Now type in your email address. Please ensure that you use a valid address because we will be using it as the identity for your account. And if you ever need to log in and download any of your ebooks again, it will be required. Read through our terms and conditions, and then click to accept. Now click redeem. On this screen, you need to select how you want to read your ebook. This list has several categories. In your case, you want to select from the dedicated e-reader category and choose Kobo. Next, click the download button. Your ebook file will be quickly prepared for delivery during this process, we also insert your email address into the book file for security purposes. This page asks you to please connect your e-reader to your computer before proceeding any further. So dig out the cable and attach your reader to your computer, then click Next. Now your e-book is ready to be downloaded. Go ahead and right-click the right-click here button. This will open a menu on your computer and you will need to select Save Target As if you are using Internet Explorer. If you are using Firefox or Chrome, select Save Link As. Now a new window on your computer will open asking you where to save the ebook. Scroll down along the left-hand column to your Kobo icon. It will be called Kobo eReader and select it as the place to save your ebook. Your book will now begin to download. You can check out the progress of your download in the Download Progress window within your browser. In our case, we have chosen to download it with Internet Explorer and you can access that here. Once the ebook has been saved to your e-reader, you can go back to your Finder window and eject your Kobo. Let's open up the Kobo now and have a look. If you have a newer Kobo, you will see your new ebook right on the opening screen. If you have an older Kobo, you will need to navigate to your book section. and then tab through alphabetically to the right letter corresponding with the first letter in the title of your new book. Okay, there it is. We hope that this video walkthrough has been helpful for you. Thank you for following along. If you are still having issues, please do not hesitate to check out our FAQ section. If you can't find the answer to your problem there, please contact our support team for further assistance. Happy reading.